Hey guys, let's do a quick flashback. The mobile displays that we are using from a decade had increased in terms of quality and punchy colors. From using LCD panels to OLED and AMOLED displays, the mobile displays have come far from what we expected. From single panel to foldable displays, companies are doing their best. But the Samsung is taking the things to the next level. Ahead of this week's Society of Information Displays SDI exhibition, Samsung Display teased several of its upcoming foldable OLED panels. We get a sneak peek at the brand's S foldable panel as well as sideable options and a large screen panel for the laptops with a built-in camera under the panel, which Samsung will work in its upcoming future devices. The S foldable screen folds at the two points, giving you the flexibility to adjust the design desired screen real estate on the flight depending on the task at hand. The screen diagonal expands up to 7.2 inches when fully opened but there is also a more manageable form factor with just one unfold. The front facing camera are housed in the left hand side bezels of the display. In addition we get a look at the sideable display prototype which features a horizontal expanding display that also allows for gradual adjustment. In its unfolded state, the demo device appears around the same size as a conventional smartphone but with the press of a button the screen can expand by the several millimeters to present a large canvas for a multitasking and media consumption samsung also showcased a 17 inches foldable display which folds in half similar to microsoft surface neo tablet and lenovo's thinkpad x1 fold the panel supports a 4.3 aspect ratio design with productivity in the mind it can be used in both portrait and landscape orientations lastly we get a glimpse of samsung Samsung's plans for a nearly bezel-less laptop. The display features an integrated front-facing camera beneath the top bezel. The result is quite impressive and ensure a maximum screen real estate. The only question is if Samsung can work out the camera quality. What do you think about this display? Let me know in the comment section. For that said, subscribe if you like and I will see you in the next one.